Hello everyone, this is Joe and uh, I'm just hanging out in my front yard tonight and uh, it is just so beautiful out here tonight. I figured we'd just have a quick little walk and talk. So everybody come and walk with me for a minute. All right, so I'm actually out here because I was out here earlier. You know, it was so hot today that, you know, I'm just, I work mostly from home. So I was just at home doing some work in the in the house and I says, well, I'll go out and cut the grass once it cools down a little bit. And uh, so about 7.30, I think I came out. I actually went and got some gas for the lawnmower. And then I came back home and started doing the edging and I edged all the sidewalks and everything and the curb and it started spitting rain. And I'm like, oh, well, I guess I'm not going to be able to finish this tonight. And today was perfect because, or this evening was perfect because, I mean, the temperature had really dropped. And so I was like, wow, this is going to be really nice um, to cut the grass now because I'm not going to be all sweaty when I get done. And uh, so, unfortunately, it started spitting rain. And I'm like, you know what? Oh, well, at least I got the edging done. So tomorrow when I come back, I can just... Uh, cut the grass I won't have to worry about edging um, but that nice breeze started blowing and I just like I haven't done this in so long just come out and enjoyed my front yard you know I like it to look nice but um, I rarely come out and actually enjoy it so um, it was nice to be able to come out here and just sit in my driveway in a little lawn chair and enjoy the breeze and the coolness of the evening and uh, interestingly today I found out uh, some news I wasn't really really wanting to hear and it's nothing life-threatening or anything like that but I mean there's all kind of trials and this is a major trial but yet and still all I can say is God is good because I could be so much worse off than I actually am. So, you know, and that's, I think we got to get to that place in life where we understand and know that God has our back. And um, know that he actually does care about us. I don't do many of these kind of videos. Actually, I think this may be my first uh, in a long, long time of videos like this. I used to do them on my Facebook page a long time ago, but I'm just glad that I just sit out here and actually have a peaceful evening. So I'm hoping that all of you are having a peaceful evening as well and that you've had a blessed day and that whatever you're going through, you'll understand and know that you are loved and you are cared for and there's always somebody who's worse off than you than you <laughs> and um, don't take joy in knowing that but understand that sometimes I know I've been in this very boat so I'm not telling somebody to do something I haven't done I've been in this boat plenty of times where I thought, oh, man, woe is me, woe is me. And, you know, even still today, I sometimes will have a pity party. But I, I thank God that he quickly reminds me of um, his goodness, mercy and grace. And I thank him for that. So I hope all of you, even when those down times, you understand that um, God has our back. And, you know, sometimes there are people out there worse off than us. And so I definitely do count my blessings. I'm. Uh, very grateful for what I have and um, actually also grateful for what I don't have because we always think we need certain things in our lives and even certain people in our lives and it doesn't always work out that way and um, you know it's a sometimes a hard painful lesson but regardless of where you are please listen to the voice of God and trust in him Proverbs 3, 5, and 6 says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not into your own understanding. In all of your ways acknowledge him and he shall direct your paths. I know everybody doesn't believe that. Everybody is not a follower of God, but 
Um, you'll never convince me that his word isn't true. I've seen too much in my lifetime. 55 years is not the oldest, but hey, I've been around long enough to know that he is there and that he cares. So I'm out of here. I'm going to go sit back in my chair for another half hour or so and just reflect on some things. And I pray that um, you have a blessed evening as well. And um, we'll see you on the next video, whether it's cooking or some drone flying or whatever it is. So take care and God bless you.